So here it is. I phoned eBay to complain about their fees and didn't get much satisfaction so I asked to speak to a supervisor and I've been on hold for, as you can see here, over 15 minutes and they've been playing this music over and over again. So this is how eBay handles complaints. They do a horrible, annoying, let's just see if we can wear the person out. So I wonder how long it'll go for. I'll just record it and maybe put it on YouTube to show people that eBay is not a friendly place when you disagree with what they want to charge you. So what they do is they not only charge you a listing fee and a selling fee, they actually charge you money on what you pay to ship it. So that isn't even money that's in your pocket. That's money you pay to ship the item. And they charge you 10% on that, which is astounding to me and unfair. They can share in the sale of an item on eBay. I think that's fair. But they shouldn't take a portion of what it costs you to mail the item. That's just gouging. That's just creepy. So we'll see how long this goes. And, um, yeah, eBay, not always nice. Oh, look it. Now we've got new music, and I think the new music is because they think, oh, you must like listening to that other music, so we'll try and annoy you with classical. But I actually love classical. We'll see how this goes. In just a moment. Let's see, 1750 was that announcement. Let's see. So it's me again. On CBC there's a show called Marketplace and they did a whole special on uh, the lack of, public, of um, customer service and this was one of the tactics they listed was how they just try and wear you out and annoy you and uh, they're trying. I'm actually busy over here doing other things but Oh, and that was over a minute ago we had that message before, but was with a woman. Hmm.
back with you as quickly as we can. Thanks for calling. So now apparently I have no music. So this could be the next tactic they use where it starts going beep, 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 beep. Oh. Oh, please wait. Oh, yep. Extension not valid. I ought to get the beep, beep, beep soon where they cut me off. Oh, look it. I got that one. I got the classical music back. So I said to eBay I was ticked off. And they said, I said I wanted to talk to somebody else. So now I'm getting the stall tactic. Do you remember Marketplace talked about how they just try and annoy the crap out of you? So I'm videoing it. I'm going to put it on YouTube. <laughs> oh, and YouTube doesn't actually charge fees. That's pretty cool. Yes. Hello, Miss Dixon. How are you doing today? I'm good. How are you? Well, I'm doing good as well. Thank you for asking. Good. So, um, according to my representative, um, the reason um, why you are calling us today is because you have a concern about the final value fee on shipping, in particular, that we are now charging to the sellers like you. Is that correct, Miss Dixon? Oh, yeah. I think that's absolutely outrageous that you do that. And so um, I'm a I've actually been recording this whole call um, because um, I also want a record of this uh, conversation. So I just wanted to let you know because your person told me that it might be recorded and I'm actually recording it on my cell phone right now. Um, it's fine, ma'am. Yep, good. Um, I just wanted to say that I am not prepared to, to share money that I've spent for shipping an item with eBay. Okay. That is outrageous. And so I want those fees uh, refunded. Well, unfortunately, ma'am, we do not issue um, refund for final value on shipping. 
uh, well, who else can I talk to? Because that's outrageous that you would charge people uh, for money for shipping something. You can you can share in the the sale of the item, but this is just gouging. This is just outrageous that you would charge me a fee on what I, it costs me to mail something. Okay, I understand where you're coming from, ma'am. But unfortunately, there's no one else that you can talk to about this issue um, except me today. If you would like, we can always arrange for a callback. But then again, I cannot tell you if what would be the exact time or day that someone from our higher up can call you back with regards to... Yeah, I, I really want to hear and from I'm higher up. To be I... honest with you that even if you were going to talk to someone who is higher than me, they will tell you the same thing. Okay, well, I'm going to put this little video on YouTube because I think people should know because if they sell an item for a couple of bucks, they're going to they're going to end up owing you money uh instead of getting any money themselves. So, I would suggest to people to not list on eBay. And um I I just think it's outrageous. Fine, it will always be your option. Yeah, I understand that and I'm not I'm not threatening you. I'm just informing you, but I do want to call back. That's fine, ma'am. Anything else? Uh no. Um I would like just an idea. Is it going to be within a week? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And your name again was? My name is Lawrence. Lawrence. Yes. Okay, and it'll be within a week. And who, what department is going to be calling me? Well, someone who is higher than me. Right, and what, what does that mean? An archangel or something? From what department are they going to be calling me they from? Are, we're actually from general support team. Right, and so the gentleman I talked to before you also had a Filipino accent. Am I talking to someone in the Philippines? Um, yes. Yes, so I'm talking completely offshore to the Philippines. Okay. Um, I, I think people should know that too. Um, so you don't actually have really any power even though you're a supervisor, right? You can just no, sort sir, of... that's actually the policy of eBay that we need to comply. Right. Okay, and so the person who's higher up, what is the higher up in? Is it in customer support? Is it in... That it's within their customer support. That is our manager. So your manager, and and you are a supervisor. Supervisor, yes. Okay. Person above me. Right. Good. I expect to hear from that person. And is there anyone that I can hear from the actual company? Because you're just an offshore um, group that that fields calls from from um, eBay in sellers. Regards to this one. Um, I can actually provide you the corporate number of eBay. Do you oh. have a pen and paper in handy? Oh, I do. If you would like to bring this issue to our corporate office? Yes, please. Okay, one moment, please. Okay, the number would be area code 800 322-9266. So that's 800-322-9266. That is correct, ma'am. Good. Thank you, Lawrence. You're welcome. Thank Bye. you as well for yep. using eBay. Have a great day. Yeah, you Bye. too. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. So wasn't that fascinating?